I, I live in, in, in Barry Cook's old house in Thomastown and the studio that he had built in the handball alley, the last remaining handball alley in Thomastown. And I had known Barry previously um, before he moved to Thomastown, but just very briefly. So he lived beside me for about seven years in, in the house where I live now. And then one day he and his partner, Jean, came by to say, I was living next door actually, came by to say, we're moving to Sligo. And I was, oh my God, that's terrible. I really miss you. But can I get your house? So <laughs> we very quickly did a deal and actually were able to buy the house from Barry and Jean without recourse to auctioneers or anything. And Barry was absolutely thrilled. Barry was, I suppose, my first mentor. And when I was working in, my, in the house before I moved to his house, he, he used to call by um, and look at the work that I was doing and basically tell me to keep going and just say, yes, keep going. He didn't tell me to stop. He didn't say, oh, no, you're no good at this. Do something else. He, he said, keep going. So he, he gave me the confidence to keep going. And ever after that, he, he never really said that much. He, he wouldn't um, like, like point to anything in your work, but he might say something fairly quiet that would just make you think. And then when he had moved to Sligo, every so often he'd come back to, to visit. And usually he wouldn't phone or anything. I mightn't even know he was coming. And he'd just turn up at the door and I'd be there and he'd come in. And he'd always ask if he could look at the work in the studio. And he'd always say, just something small that would be really helpful. And I, I sort of used to think of him as, at times, as almost like an angel appeared, you know, just when I needed him. Um, so we continued to be friends always up until his death. And his work, definitely, I, I would have looked at a lot and, and still would at times the sort of free freedom that he had within his work and also his interest in ecology which is something i would have an interest in as well